Shaber 1000 here. Today we're going to be checking out this 8 inch selfie ring light studio with 51 inch, 51 inch extendable tripod and phone holder. It's made by Bauer. This came from Walmart. So let's open this up and let's check it out. See if it's any good. Okay guys, so this is what we got here today. Like I said, it's 8 inch ring light studio. Bluetooth. Now what that is, it's just a... I'll show it to you here in a minute. I've, I got something, a selfie stick or something here not too long ago. And one of those was with it. Uh, for use with most, most smartphones. No, it's not. Uh, I've tried it on three different phones and... <clears throat> Uh, it's probably for Apple or some shit, but anyway, it's got three light colors plus nine levels of brightness Okay <clears throat> Like I said, it was 30 bucks 29.99 or whatever uh, It's great for vlogging live videos video chats social media live streaming health and beauty and again, it's uh 51 it'll go up to 51 inches tall on the tripod wireless remote included that's for your phone which like i said i don't think now my phone will pick up the one i've got but it won't pair so i don't know ultra wide range and it's got 72 leds in it <clears throat> now the one i usually put on top here a uh, monkey like this i think she's going to do a review on it as well the one i usually put on top of my camera like it's very very bright even on its lowest setting um so let me get a knife here so that being said maybe this will be a little bit uh not so bright you know what i mean a little softer light because that that one i got it's awesome but it's for it's like to light up a whole room and if you got that shining in your face, you know, sometimes you'll see a squinting or whatever. That's, that is why. And they want, they want us to like and subscribe. Well, you are a creator. Oh, there you go, guys. Like and subscribe, will you? Okay, so it shows you what's in the box. We get. We get the 8 inch ring light, extendable tripod, phone holder with pivot mount. Okay, now that, that, that'll come in handy, I'm sure, not, even if we're not using this thing. Wireless remote shutter, smartphone clip adapter. <clears throat> and it's got all the features here. Um, I'll read them to you here real quick. Make videos at night or take great selfie in dark areas. Take great selfie in dark areas. Shouldn't that be, shouldn't that be take a great selfie in dark areas? Or take great selfies in dark areas? Anyway, great for creating live videos with smartphone or computer. Perfect for vlogging, live videos, video chat, social media, live streaming health and beauty and more um, dimmable LED ring light has 72 LEDs a long-lasting brightness choose from three light colors and nine level brightness within each mode oh we get nine levels of brightness in each mode so three times nine there you go easy control on cord to power on off or switch to the lighting mode you prefer this ring light makes every photo and video look more professional anyway it goes on uh, no batteries needed it is usb powered so apparently you got to plug it in which i think i've got a thing for that let's go ahead and open this up here um let's see here 
I'll back you up here a little bit. And then I'm, <laughs> I raised you up just to lay you back down. Okay, here we go. Here is the tripod. Okay. And yes, already it feels cheap. It's like that. It's, I'll show you. I got it right here. It's similar to this thing I made for holding uh, uh, I made it to hold the light but it's actually for um, what do you call it? IV drips that's what that's for okay so there's the tripod let's take this out this must be the cord Okay, there's there's that that little deal right there I can guarantee you it's not going to work on either of our phones like I said I tried both of my phones and her phone and it didn't work on either of them so this is for your for your phone We'll mostly be using this for the camera. There's for your phone. This must be the, uh, you know, the swivel thing there. Okay, where's the cord? Set this over here. We'll put this over here. This here. This here. This over here. Hopefully the cord's in here somewhere. It's got course your paperwork your how-to thing follow and tag us no I'm not doing all that so there's there's your modes and there's how you hook all this stuff up your phone and uh, <clears throat> I may use just a regular tripod in certain applications because We'll just have to see how sturdy that thing is. I know, I know, my hater. Well, what do you want for 30 bucks? Well, I want something that's worth 30 bucks. If that's the price they got on it, then, you know, I want stuff to, like I hate when people go, oh, geez, like that taco video. It's only a dollar, what do you expect for a dollar? Well, I don't care if it's a dollar or a hundred dollars. I expect it to be good. I expect it to be edible, not, Buy a bunch of things for a dollar, take it home, throw them away. Just giving away money. They wouldn't like it either. Those are the kind of people I'd like to do some work on a car real cheap. And make it last like two days. And then when they bring it back, be complaining about it. Oh, what do you want? I only charged you $50 for all new brakes. <laughs> well, I want them to stop. Yeah. Well, I wanted to be able to eat them tacos too, but I couldn't. Okay, so anyway... So here's, here's the uh, the light, and here's this. Because, uh, you know, we have a lot of, well, not a lot. We have a lighting issue in the kitchen, you know, because the light's always behind us. And then in the daytime, like I said, if it's, you know, if we got the window, the door, the window of the door, the blinds inside the door open, then, you know, it, uh, you can't have the camera pointing that way. So there's that. Now, here's the thing. This, you have to find one of those, and I forgot to bring mine in, but I'll go get it. Find one of those, you know, square things that you plug this into, or you plug it into your computer, or whatever. So I'm going to go get, <coughs> now let's go ahead and open this up. monkey sleeping so tomorrow's Christmas Eve and if you're watching this tomorrow today's Christmas Eve <laughs> so, yeah this feels really really unstable here Okay. All right. Let's just 
just get it like that. We'll tighten this up a little bit. Now, this is one of those, so you turn it to unlock it, and it slides up like that. And I'm guessing the same here. Is that it? I need, I need 50 inches. There, that might be. And lock it up. Wait, still going, still going, guys. Okay, there. All right, it's supposed to be 51 inches. Shall we see? Get a rough idea here. 51 inches? Well, without anything on it, to the top of it's 53 and a half, so to the bottom of this is 51. So, alright, so, okay, that's fine, but like I said, this one here is a lot taller, <laughs> but and it's, I think it's more sturdier than this thing. I'll probably see if I can put this stuff onto that other one. I don't know. We'll have to see. This, yeah, this feels. Feels janky. You know what I mean? It's just like. I don't know. That's going to hold this light and a phone. And open this up here. Down here. Wow, this thing's heavy. Yeah, this is real heavy here, guys. Hmm. Yeah, it's just. Oh, it's janky. How does this go on here? Oh, let's see. So this will clip on. It just feels like everything's going to break. I open that up too far to get it on here. Okay, so there's that. I don't know. There's a phone holder. So this must go up on top here like this. So then it'll do all different stuff. I darn sure wouldn't try to put a camera on this thing. So you move that around and tighten that up or so I do like that it's really versatile like that, but uh, it just it just feels real janky man I mean okay I'll just say cheap okay it just feels real cheap it's got these things up here right there right here on the sides you can put different things in them. I don't have a light here right now with me, do I? Or do I? Yeah, I do. Uh, this old light here. Like, you know. You're supposed to be able to, like, put another light on there. But, man, you get a phone and stuff on there. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see. Okay, so let's take this back out. This light burn up on me. We kept smelling something hot one day. I came out here. This was laying here. And it was smoking. For no reason. Wasn't plugged in or anything. So. 
that's got IR lights in it. I figured I can use it for, for those and build something. Okay, so I'm going to go get my my charging device here. or Well, not charging. It don't charge, guys. It's just got to have power to it all the time. But I'll show you what I'm going to use. Hang on a second. Okay, guys, I am back. Um, I'll show you what I'm going to use here. Let me shut this thing off. Remember this? I reviewed it not that long ago. This is also a power bank. Okay, this is where you charge it. Now you can use this to like run your phone or whatever. Now it's not a charger, but it is a power bank. We're just gonna stick this in here. That comes on there. That's telling me there's something plugged into it. It's got three lights or three bars, so it's charged up now here's our little thing here let's turn this on okay so it starts off apparently on the highest setting I don't like that okay so it was on one that's two there's three four five six seven eight nine it's actually got ten maybe eleven what Okay, so this is one setting, right? There's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Wow, it's got eleven on it. Let's say there's eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five four three two one yeah it's got 11 okay cool now this middle button here is where you'll change your color there's that i'll turn it up a little bit so you can see it more and there's that i like that one that's nice Okay, so I'm going to spin this around and spin you guys around. I'm going to shut this light off in the background here. Okay, first let me shut this off. And then I'll spin this around. I wonder if I can... This might be a great idea here. Let's see. Oh, what a shame. It won't hold it. That's too bad. I mean, it would if you don't want to, if you don't, but whoops, I'm pushing the light. I got the heater on now. Shoot. <laughs> got to hit it twice. There we go. Well, yeah, that'll, that'll hold it. Okay. Let me get this behind the, this here behind the camera. Okay. And I'll go get my big light. And that way we can kind of see the difference in, in how this light is compared to that big light. Uh, which has, it's got multiple light settings too. But like I said, it will not go as low as this. And it's just a square light. It's mainly for, like I said, just uh, like lighting up a whole room. So I'm going to set this back here. I'll show you where I got it set. It just feels janky. It looks cool, but... Okay, now I'm going to have you guys sitting right back here, just like this, okay? And then what I'll be doing is showing different lights. Like, if you're filming or something, you really don't want a bright light behind you. This one's not too bad, but this one sometimes gets a little too bright, so like, you shut it off and you know looks a little better because you get that light shining at you so let me go get my big light and we'll see a difference i'll go ahead and take this mic off i got a mic on here because when i'm standing beside the camera it'll like be more to the left if you're listening with your headphones so i got this camera pointed that way because i was on that side of them so that way it's still left and right so i'm gonna go ahead and i'm i'm gonna shut this i'm gonna take this off and get my big light and then we'll see the difference. So hang tight, guys. Okay, guys. I got old blue here just to show you the setup. Okay. 
there's the new selfie light. Um, okay, like I said, look at that little. I mean, that thing is small. I mean, see the difference? Um, it just feels janky. But anyway, so there's there's the big light. There's that light, and you know it's on the tripod. So. Um, I'm going to go ahead and turn this back on and film from this that camera there. As you can see, I'm not filming yet, but uh and then I also have this light. Okay, LED light and it has three different settings and I also have this cover that um How's it going here? It goes in here. Oh, you take this uh, clear cover off and then you can put this cover on there. I'll just hold it on there for a second so you can get an idea. Okay, so there's that. So next clip, we're going to be filming with this. And then I'll show you the different lights. I'll start out with no lights. Okay, guys, we're back. Now, I'm going to start out with this little light. The light we use for old blue. <clears throat> Alright, I'm going to start out with this one. Okay, hopefully it's charged. I'm going to hold it on top of the camera like it would be. Okay, start this. Okay, there's that. Uh, like I said, if you're looking at the camera, it, it's blind to me. There's medium. And there's high. But it's really bright. I mean, it looks good here. But looking at the camera, it's really bright. You know, you have to have it up like that. And then sometimes you can't get the angles you want. Okay, so there you go. Now let's go ahead and shut this one off. Now we're going to go with the big light, the big square one up on top here. All right. And again, that's a badass light, but it's very, very bright in my eyes. Okay, so there's that. Let's um, take it up. That's three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so it's got seven light settings. Um, looks good, looks great, but it's very, very bright. So let's take this down all the way. Now it's got a filter, like I said in the last clip. You can take that clear filter off and put this on if it's too bright for your eyes, but it kind of changes the color as well. Okay, so I'm just going to hold that on there. I'm going to keep turning it up here. Okay, but see like right there, it's not as bad, but it's still brighter than hell, especially if I take that off of there. Okay, so let's shut this off. That's why when we turn lights on, you'll see monkeys sometimes go. That's why, because it's very, very bright. Now, we're going to, I got the controller right here for that light. Let's turn it on. Wait, I got to turn the battery bank on here. There we go. I think. There we go. All right, now let's turn that on. Okay, so let's see. We're gonna start clear down on low. All right, there's low. All right, so that's, you know, doable. And I can put that, I can, I can make that to where it can go up here on top of the camera if I wanted, but that's going to be more in the house wise. Or if we're outside, like I said, I can bring that battery bank right there. So, so yeah, so it's got 10 settings, not nine. It says nine levels of brightness for each color. It's not right. It's not so it wouldn't be what 27. It'd be 30. So that's cool. Now let's get it turned all the way down. Okay. Also, if I hold the button 
I can stop that wherever I want. So let's make it brighter. I can stop it there or I can make it dimmer just by holding the button I can bring it all the way down all right so there's that one now let's go with the color now this color that's on here now would be for this would be the color that this was on that okay so let's bring the brightness up on it and I'm looking at the camera and that's not bothering me that's not that's not bothering me at all it's a little bright yes but it is not bothering me and well I'll have to go you know through editing and see like if I bring it closer uh, and tell the difference on here because if I turn this light on you know to me that's too bright it kind of makes everything appear dark um, but I'll turn it on like when I have you pointing down this way but let's see okay so all right now let's take it all the way back down and let's go with the soft light all right yeah it's got 10 settings so and again you just push your your middle button there there's a soft kind of like what I got over there above the this wash and dryer okay so uh, let's bring it up there's two three four five six seven eight nine ten there we go well whoops <laughs> there we go ten so I do kind of like that um, and I'm looking right in the camera it is not bothering me um, of course it's not going to get hot it's LEDs and I mean yeah that's yeah that's kind of awesome and if um, yeah, there we go. there's the differences in them so let me turn it down a little bit and I can stop them just holding it here you can probably see the difference in it depending on how you need it so we did need a light like this. I wasn't going to get it, but I thought, yeah, she made a good point. And like I said, this stupid thing here, you know, these things, I don't even, I, I don't know. I've never seen anybody using these. It's, it's for your phone to, like, if you got your phone up here, you can have this down here. Click, take a selfie or click, start recording. I know the other one don't pair up to my phone, but... Who knows, right? I think they're all they're all pretty much the same. But let's go ahead. I'll get my phone out here. I'm gonna put this battery in here, and we'll just see. It's also got a little lanyard on it. Yes, okay, so I'm gonna put the battery in here. Like I said, it will pick it up, but it won't pair. I mean, which is never made sense to me when something can pick it up, but they but it won't pair with your, you know. Come on. Yeah, that's plus. Having trouble getting this. There we go. That's that's just what it is right there, guys. You know, here's your on off. Same thing as that other one I got. I'm I'm sure it's not going to pair. But let me get my phone out here and I'll see. Like I said, I got the RAV4 Plus. I, I So I don't think it's going to connect. But let me go grab my phone. Okay, guys. So here's another Plus. It does have a long cable. So I can, uh, I can just hang this cable right here at this camera. And if I need to change the light and do it right here so that's kind of cool just thought I'd show you that but all right on with the review let's go ahead and get this try to see if this will pair up to my phone step one pairing okay 
turn on the power button located on the side of the remote that's the button I just showed you right there on the side indicator LED flashes and AB shutter 3 will enter into pairing mode turn on your smartphone and search for AB shutter 3 device okay so let's do that it's on okay so let's go let's turn on oh shit that's Wi-Fi let's turn on Bluetooth okay let's be on it's searching let's try pair new device okay there it brought it up it did bring it up first one AB shutter 3 okay and then it says select the device of AB shutter 3 from the list and pairing will be finished automatically in a few seconds so I'm gonna click on that it it's asking me so maybe it maybe it will work on this one allow access to your contacts and whatever okay pair it says it's connecting right there <clears throat> but that's what the other one did too it says currently connected so let's go to camera let's put this on camera and let's see if it will take a picture wow it's um it's zooming but it's whoa It's zooming in and out. Okay, it zoomed in, but it's not taking a picture. It zoomed way the hell in, but it's not. I zoomed it back out again. See it's zooming, but it won't zoom out. And it's not taking a picture. So like I said, what I don't know what good that is if you gotta reach up here, you know what I mean? You can just reach up here and, and, and take the picture. All it's doing is zooming in. It's not even zooming out. So. Yeah. That's um, like I said. No matter what button I push. It's zooming it in. So. That doesn't make sense to me. I mean, does it work? Technically, yeah, but it's only zooming it in, and it won't, you know what I mean? Yeah, this is, these things are always junk, these little Bluetooth, these things. I can't get it to work, I'm just getting it to zoom, and it will not zoom out. So, that's weird. Maybe I'll get the other one and try to pair it again. So, <clears throat> alright, let me get the other one and I'll try it real quick and then I'll be back with you and let you know what I think about the light. So, I did find my other. I'll get it mixed up or something. 
Yeah, this one. I did find my other thing and it won't even pick it up now. It will still pick this up and pair up. Wait a minute. It's got it mixed up. I think this is the old one. Yeah, this is the old one here. Um, but I did get this one. Like I said, all it does is zoom it in and you can't zoom it out. So I don't understand what that's all about. Um, like I said, it it would pick it up before. It just wouldn't pair it to it. Now it's not even picking it up. So who knows, right? Um, so anyway, guys. So there you go. I mean what is it? it it's a light it's 30 bucks do I like the light and its features yeah I do do I like this little thing no no I don't I'd rather see him do away with this I mean normally you're sitting right here anyway I mean it's like I'm, I'm touching the light right now see so I mean a selfie you're not gonna have on the other side of the room anyway I mean unless you're that TikTok people but still start it and then do your thing um i i don't know like i said unless you you know you want to hold it down here and take a selfie instead of reaching up i i don't know i'd rather see him do away with this and build the stand a little better that stand is junk 30 bucks no it's not worth 30 bucks 15 yeah 15 bucks i i think is fair for the half half the price I don't even think it's worth $20. Um, I guess depending on your application, it may be for you. It may be worth 30 for you. To me, it's not um, because that stand, that, like I said, that stand's just junk and these other little things they give you. You know, I've got a million of these things and um, these things. I mean, come on. I do like the features. I'll be fair. I'll say fifteen to twenty dollars. I think I think twenty would be okay. I guess depending on the situation. I just don't think thirty dollars is worth it because the stand is so cheap. Um, <coughs> it does what it. I mean, you know, as far as the light itself, I give it a two thumbs up. Um, out of ten, I'll give it a seven out of ten. I do not like that stand. It's very wobbly. I mean, oh shit, I almost knocked it over right there. Um, but I do like the light, so I do give it two thumbs up. I will give it a 7 out of 10. I mean, for me, it would get a 10 out of 10 if, um, if it had a better stand. Just something to make me feel a little more comfortable. Uh, so, yeah, um... And again, like, instead of this stupid thing, you know, I'd like to see this thing rechargeable, you know, to where you can plug it in or recharge it, just charge it up and, and take it on the go where you didn't have to have a bank, a battery bank with you. But, you know, that's nitpicking. That's neither here nor there. The light does what it says it will do. In fact, I found out there's three more different, there's three more settings. There's an extra setting on each different light color so instead of nine you got ten so that's thirty you know if you want to look at it that way um, so yeah I'll give it a seven out of ten I just don't think it's worth the thirty bucks I think you know what I'm going to go ahead and say twenty yeah um, thirty bucks if it had a rechargeable battery in it or you know even if it came with with a power bank you know Instead of this stupid thing here, one of those little square power banks you plug into the wall and then you plug your phone into, if it came with one of them, I mean, it doesn't come with none of it. It, it just, you know, you got to have that thing. I mean, this is all right to plug into a computer, but, you know, I mean, if you don't have, you know, something like this or, you know, a computer, which if you're doing selfies, I mean, this this can't plug in your phone, so you have to have power somewhere. So you either got to get your power bank, or you got to be around power to where you can plug one of them square things in. Which, by the way, you're gonna have to buy. Uh, they need to throw one of them in there. You know, I mean, those things 
you know, they're cheaply made anyway. Uh, but they, I guess they think everybody's got one of them. Well, you know, some people don't, you know. Um, I guess they're thinking if they're using their phone, they can use that. Well, what if you're charging your phone and you want to use that? You know, so you're going to have to buy one of them or get you one of these things. So, you know what I mean? Any kind of power bank, you know, chargeable power bank. I just wish it would come with something like that so you didn't have to you know rely on something like this if you did want to go outdoors you know and do your selfie um i mean i i the the stand is okay um it's just not that stable if it was down to where like they've got it here like say all the way down and you got it sitting on a desk i think it would be fine but you know, all in all, a seven out of ten. That's that's not that's not bad. I don't think. Uh, I do like what the light does. Uh, I do like that a lot. The different colors, uh, you know, for different situations. You know what I mean. And the ten different lighting levels that you got with this thing. So yeah, it's not bright. It's you know, it's not too bright. I mean, it's bright enough. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's not going to compare to, to this thing here, you know, this big thing. But like I said, you know, that's shining in my eyes. That's very, very uncomfortable. Uh, it's good for outdoors and stuff or lighting up a whole room, but not to sit in front of. This one here bothers me none. It does not bother me at all. I do like it. You know, I can adjust you know I can adjust this how I want it and just tighten it up I mean it just it still feels chintzy guys it feels like it's going to break um, just if it was a little better made I think and uh, and have some kind of power source you know uh, I would like to see it with with a rechargeable battery that that would totally be awesome um, but if you're tight on money and you need a light, there's better sources out there uh, for a lot cheaper than this. If you do have the extra extra money, um, sure, go ahead and buy it. I, you know, I mean, I, I can't say I recommend it for everybody, but uh, for us, we'll get a lot of use out of it. I just wish it wasn't so expensive. You know, like I said, the thirty bucks would be great if it had some kind of power source to it but it doesn't you have to come up with that you got to either plug it in your computer but if you're using it for selfies you know your computer's not going to be there to plug it into so you got to find an outlet and after you find that outlet you got to use your phone thing and if you're charging your phone while you're doing I, I mean like I said you got to come up with your own power source I wish it had a power source of some kind um, like I said charge rechargeable batteries would be great because you know, then it'd be well worth the 30 bucks, but anytime, you know, you're talking about camera equipment, you're going to pay. You're going to pay through the snow, and I, I know this, you know, but uh, I buy a lot of camera equipment, but, you know, all in all, 7 out of 10, yeah, it's, it's worth getting if you can get it on sale. I wouldn't pay the $30 for it myself. But if you're really in need and, you know, I mean, if you got the extra money, by all means, pick it up. But don't say, well, Shea Bear, you said it was great. No, I'm, I am no means saying it's great. I'm saying the light itself, I'm giving 7 out of 10 uh, because I do like its functions. You get, you know, one extra light setting for each color that it's saying 9, but it's actually got 10 settings. So that's cool. Um just the price it's, you know it's really right now my main complaint is the price I mean I can get over I mean that thing you know that light it just screws on just like a camera does you can put it on any tripod if you don't feel comfortable with it so you know if you're into doing this a lot I'm sure you got an extra tripod um, don't buy a tripod from there at all they are junk they're all junk don't ever buy a tripod from there. Go go find a used one. As long as it's got the base plate, you'll be fine. Go online and get you a good tripod. But 
so you know I can overlook the I can overlook the stand because like I said I've got extra tripods and it'll fit any tripod so it just screws on like a camera um, so that's not bad it's just the, the the price and not having a power source I don't understand that I mean you have to have power your own power I mean it should come with some kind of power source give us one of them little plug-in deals I forget what they're called you know just you know same thing your, your phone cord plugs into give us one of those at least for 30 bucks man what the hell is this come on no <laughs> there you go guys you know if if you have one let me know if you like it let me know in the comments uh, I, we'll get a lot of use out of it long after that stands broke and gone and bent I've got other stands for it so as long as the light holds out like I said again it feels kind of cheap but like this light here can yeah, bring this over here in front of you this light here like this little light it can go up in this uh I don't have my glasses on. See, it can go in there. Let me bring it down here. Like that. So if I, you know, if I need more light or monkey needs more light, there you go, you know. So I can put this on there. So I do like that. It just, it just, it does feel cheap. It does feel really cheap, but uh, for 30 bucks, but hey, you know, it is what it is. I, I understand camera equipment's expensive, but Yep, 7 out of 10. There's this, it's got its pros and cons um, Would I have bought this again? No, I wouldn't have gave $30 for it if I knew what I know now But I mean we got it. We might as well keep it and use it because I do like that. It's not bright. It's a little bright, but it's not to where you can't stand it like that big one up there. So yeah, it's uh there you go, guys. So you you know, it depends on your application as well, you know. How much light do you need and uh how little light can you get by with and stuff like that. Like I say, that's that's all the way on bright. Um let's change the uh So there's a different color. There's a different color. So you know, it just depends on uh, on your application. It may vary. I like it. I think Monkey will like it. I just wish it wasn't thirty. <laughs> but we got it now. We might as well keep it. Uh, that phone holder. I don't know. I mean, like I said, here's the phone holder on it, right? Right here's the phone holder. So, this is my way of thinking. You got this in your hand. You can't touch that right there. You know? Like, I mean, come on. There's your phone. <laughs> so, you need this. I don't know. I don't know. I guess I'm just nitpicking, but this is stupid in my book. <laughs> Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. I'm gone for now. Thanks for watching, guys. <coughs> Again, tomorrow's Christmas Eve, so that makes today the 23rd. So, if you're watching this tomorrow... Merry Christmas. And if you're not watching it tomorrow, Merry Christmas, guys. And uh, we'll chat at you soon. Stay tuned for more videos. We're going to have some fun tomorrow night. We're going to play some games and stuff. So uh, I may get on stream for a little bit. We'll just have to see. But we're definitely going to film some stuff. Uh, a monkey wants to film me opening presents for some reason. She says she got a couple things for me that are really cool that she had for a while and she can't wait for me to open them. So I can't wait either and I can't wait for her to open her presents uh, for me and her mother. So with that being said guys, Shea Bear the Myth the Man Legend, I'm gone for now. Bye bye guys, Merry Christmas and we'll see you soon.